it's natural light. There's just enough clouds in the sky. It's beautiful. Um, anyway. <laughs> I know, right? The camera's on a tripod, I'm sat down, I'm talking to you, what's happening? Uh, a while ago, I was sat there editing and I realised that I never really introduced myself to you guys. I mean, I vlogged all summer and it was great. Uh, by the way, 40 days of summer is not over. This is day 35 or something. But yeah, I realized that I never introduced myself in English properly to you guys, so here we are. Hi, I'm Mel, or Mayel, but neither of those are my name, it's just like two versions of my name that people in English can pronounce, because apparently my name is too weird to be pronounced, uh, because I'm French, yeah, I should have started by that. I'm French, I'm from France, I grew up in the French Alps, there we go. Uh, and my real name is Mael. Yep. So for English people, when they're trying it, I just sound like male or male. Or, yeah, not a name, basically. So I go by Mel or Mayel. My English teachers always called me Mayel, because that was easier, I guess. Uh, but I got used to Mel living in Oregon. Everyone's calling me Mel, so... Yes, I'm Mel. Long introduction for a name. I am 22 years old. I am going to turn 23 next December. Um, and I'm currently in my last year of a master degree in environmental science and territorial development. I think that's what it call it's called. Environmental science and territorial development. Yep, that sounds about right. That's what I'm doing. I know what I'm studying, of course. Um, I am minoring in forestry and natural resource management because I want to work with trees. I know, right, what a surprise. Uh, no, but seriously, I would love to work as a natural resource manager or something. Uh, and yeah, just help protect our forest because I love that. So because I don't really know what else to tell you or how to properly introduce myself, because usually when you introduce yourself, you're talking to a person and I'm just talking to a camera while sat on my bed while people could potentially watch me from outside. I guess it looks really weird from outside. I just have a tripod and a camera. Anyway, that's not the point. That was really loud, sorry. <laughs> I will not clap again. Um, so I have a list of get to know you questions on my computer, which is like quick fire questions. So we'll go through that and I guess you'll get to know me. That's what it's called. Cats or dogs? Dogs, definitely dogs. I don't like cats. Tea or coffee? I don't mind tea, but I would say coffee just because it keeps me awake. Trousers or skirts? Definitely not skirts. I'm a bit of a tomboy, a bit. Uh, so trousers, definitely. Trousers are pants if you live in the US. City or countryside? Countryside. I don't like living in a city. I'm really happy that I'll be done living here um, and that I could go back to where I come from, which is a smaller village. I guess it's not a village, it's a town, but it's in the Alps. Very nice. It's not a big city. I, I'm not a city person, so. Summer or winter? Winter. I love snow and skiing and cold air and everything about winter. And summer is just me turning into a big ball of sweat and being too moist and then burning because of the sun. <sighs> yeah, I don't tan, I burn. Birthday of Christmas. Uh, considering it's like literally two days apart for me, it's like pretty much the same. In fact, we always kind of merge my birthday and Christmas. So I'm gonna say Christmas just because it's like gathering with your family and stuff. Lord of the Ring or Harry Potter? I have to say Harry Potter. I grew up with Harry Potter, reading the books, watching the movies. That's literally my childhood and teenagehood. Lord of the Ring is great, but I mean, Harry Potter, come on. Netflix or YouTube? YouTube all the way, that's not even a question. 
phone call or text? Text. I don't like calling people, even if it's my friend. I'm like really awkward on the phone. So yeah, texting. iOS or Android? Android all the way. I never had an iPhone, don't think I would. Don't know why you would spend $300. I don't even know how much it costs for a phone that will break every time you sneeze on it, so. Sneakers or sandals? Sneakers, all the way. Glasses or contacts? Glasses. I cannot wear contacts. It's like the thing about touching your eyeball with your finger. I know you're not, like, you're not pressing your finger into your eyeball. You have the contact. But still, I cannot watch someone do it, so I don't, I, yeah, I don't think I could do that on myself. So glasses. Passenger or driver? Um, I do have my driver license and I think I'm a pretty good driver, but if I can avoid it, I'd rather be a passenger. I don't like driving that much because um, I feel like it's losing your time. Okay, you guys actually don't know that because you can't see it. I usually edit it out, but in between the clips that I'm going to use, I like talk to myself so that when I edit the video, I remember what I wanted to do. So like in between the clips, I'm like, oh, let's cut that, let's blah, blah, blah. As if someone was here. I'm just literally talking to my future self through a camera, if that makes sense. Back to a normal clip. <laughs> Train or plane? Uh, depend where you're going. I mean, obviously going to the US, you need a plane because that's literally half a planet away. But other than that, train is fine. If you're in France, train in the US kind of sucks. Oceans or mountains? I mean, is that even a question? Mountains. I grew up in the Alps. I love skiing, I love snow, I love hiking, I love forest. Mountains, duh. Well, there we go. I feel like we've gone through quite a lot of subjects. It's kind of good for an introduction, I guess. I don't really know how to do it, but I really wanted to introduce myself to you guys just because it's a bit weird. Like, watching me on holiday and stuff, not knowing who I am. So yeah, here I am. Welcome aboard if that's the first video you see of me. Since the point of today was to introduce myself, I feel like I want to use the remaining few days of 40 days of summer to introduce you to things I love, so baking, hiking, biking, because I'm back to school so it's not gonna be a lot of like travel and like discovering stuff videos, but I still want to show you stuff that are important to me, like I said, so yeah, stick around for the remaining days of 40 days of summer, subscribe if you're new, and don't forget to like the video if you did, and I'll see you very soon.